Hello my friends, welcome back to Anna's Mobile Home Life, and if you're new, welcome. It is early morning, and I am going to attempt to make uh, ham, egg, and cheese stuffed biscuits. I'll be using the Grand's Buttermilk Biscuits. I don't know how it's going to turn out. It could be a fail, so we're going to give it a try. So I will turn you around, get everything set up, and we will get started. As you can see here, I already chopped up some ham. I was going to show you how I chopped it up. This is two pieces. It, they kind of cut it thick. So I'm just going to fold both pieces over. Slice it. and then cut it the other way. So it's just in little squares, little chunks. So I'm gonna push that with the rest. I'm gonna do the last batch. This might be too much, I'm not sure, but we will figure it out. Okay, so we have the ham already set aside. Next, I'm going to get to my biscuits. Hopefully, this turns out right. I've never made it like this before. My oven is already heating up. So what I'm gonna do is take one of the biscuits, press it firmly, set it aside, and I'm gonna do that with each one. I'll do one more on camera, on the video, and then I'll finish off camera. You just press them as much as you can. Okay, so I'll be right back. Okay, my friends, I have the biscuits all flattened out and the ham is all chopped up. I am going to set that aside. Next, I have my electric skillet here. I'm going to add some butter. And I have a bowl and four eggs. That's what I'm going to start with. Four eggs. I'm going to add a little bit of milk. A nice splash of milk. And we're going to mix this together. It may not be enough, but we'll see. The biscuits aren't that big, so I may not be able to put, fit that much of egg in there. So I'm gonna set that aside a minute. And I'm gonna bring back over my skillet and finish melting this butter. Okay. 
Looks good. I'm just going to add the egg there. We're just going to make scrambled eggs. I'm going to add a little salt, some pepper, and we're going to get that cooking. Okay. Just move it around a bit. I hope you're all doing well today. I am still in the process of getting my home organized and set up for showings again. Oh, I just splattered egg everywhere. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to be still working at it. It is Friday and I might have I might have a showing on Sunday. So I'm getting panicky. But I'm taking time for myself to make some breakfast today. I'll have leftovers to just heat up for breakfast. So that'll be good. Okay, so I, the eggs are ready. I'm going to turn that off. That is what we've got. So I'm going to set that aside. I have a pan here, a sheet pan. I'm going to grab myself a spoon. Hopefully this turns out, guys. I have the dough that I pressed here. What I'm going to do is add a little bit of egg. Actually, you know what? I have the ham here. I'm going to put a little ham in there. Press that bigger. They shrink sometimes, so you may have to press it again. So you just put the amount of ham and filling you would like in there. If this turns out. So I got the ham. Let me see if I can make some room. You know what, I'm gonna start with those. Now I'm gonna add some egg. little bit of egg to each of them. Shredded cheddar. 
I'm going to sprinkle some cheddar on there on each one. As I make a mess as per usual, this is going to be the hard part. I need to fold these over. And then I'm going to get a fork. And press the edges. Like you're making a little apple pie. Just to seal it. That's what we've got. I'll do another on video. And then I'll do the rest off camera. So you pull it to stretch it. Roll it over. Push down a little bit. And then seal the edges. With the fork. My oven, once again, it's preheated to 375. So I'm going to finish these and then I will come back. Okay, my friends, I have them on the pan. Some of them are kind of messy. I have a feeling they're not going to seal too well. I was struggling. It is a lot of work. So some of them might ooze out or all of them. I don't know. But it's worth the try. So I'm going to get them in the oven and when they're ready, I will come back. Okay, my friends, they are ready. I'll bring them closer to you. It doesn't look like they exploded. That is what they look like. I hope they're still hot enough, but I was going to try and just melt some butter over the top of each one. Just like this, I got. I was going to melt it in the microwave, but I'm just going to do it this way. I already had a chunk cut off of the butter, so I'm just going to rub it across each one and coat it. Hopefully, they're going to all have nice melted butter on them. They look good. They really do. We're going to give it a try as soon as I get this butter on there. And we will see. I've never done this before. And in a way, I'm happy. I hope they come off the pan and they're not stuck. I didn't test that yet. So we will soon find out. I'm just going to try to use up the rest of this little bit of butter on my fork here to coat them. And we will give it a try. All right, I'm just going to set that aside. What I'm going to add, I don't know how it's going to be, but I thought I would add a little Parmesan cheese on top of the butter. As I make a mess, that's horrible. I make more of a mess for myself, and I got to get prepared for showings. <sighs> I, I make problems for myself. But I wanted to share this with you. So I'm going to grab a plate. Of course, it's going to be a paper plate because everything's packed. 
I am going to try to get one off the pan. Oh, it is stuck, kind of. Whoop! There we go. That burner's not hot. I'm going to get my knife. And we're going to cut into it. Look at that, guys. It looks good. The lighting, uh, of course, isn't good. Let me fix this. All right. Here we go. Hopefully it's not going to burn me. Once again, that's what it looks like. Here we go. Mm, mm, mm. Oh. Guys, you got to try this. It's a process, but it's worth it. I'm going to take one more bite. Mm-hmm. Yep, I'll be making these again. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you give this a try, let me know what you think. I thank you all so very much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time.